right, I am driving to Disneyland. Los Angeles traffic is just unbelievable. No matter what time of day you leave, there's always traffic. Hopefully we'll get there in time. It's around a quarter to six. I wanna see how early I can get to Disneyland, get in the parking lot, get into uh, downtown Disney, and maybe I can get there for rope drop. Keep left on Disneyland, then keep right. I've never thought I would say it, but I am the first one here. Um, as you can see right here, this is, they have the yellow bar up, uh, the barricade, so I can't go any further. This is where you pay for your parking. Um, but look at this, I'm the first one here. Now you're probably asking why that is a big deal to be the first one at Disneyland. Well, you have to understand, I'm a New York kid. I'm from New York, so uh, this is very exciting for me. I've been in LA for two years, and I am experiencing something I've never thought I would ever experience. I'd be the first one at Disneyland Park. Completely empty. Look at all the fog. Look at this, it's incredible. Then if you can see behind the fog there, that is Star Wars land. Beneath the fog. But now let's get down there and catch our trolley. Mientras el tranvía está en movimiento. Y vigilen a sus niños. Gracias. We're gonna head in and see if we get into rope drop here. But the line is pretty long. So I was waiting in the wrong line. I was waiting in the magic morning line, which uh, they're allowed to enter now. So now I have a half hour to wait for uh, general entrance. But I'll still make rope drop, I promise. And you're gonna hold on to the ticket. Thank you so much. Look at this. Look how beautiful this is with the, the low-lying fog. Got the city hall back there. This is beautiful. I've been to Disneyland a few times. I've never seen it like this with the, with the fog. It's quite beautiful. As you can see, they got rid of the, uh, the jack-o'-lantern, which was right here for Halloween. And now we have a beautiful Christmas tree. Let's see. There you go. It's a little selfie. Now I'm headed to my first stop, which is always going to be the Starbucks right here on Main Street. I had my coffee already, but I'm gonna have my second cup. It is Christmas time at Disney. drop is in uh, 10 minutes. I'm gonna get this all situated and I'm headed down to the castle. Look at that. I like that shirt. I may have to get that. So this is where you wait. This is where you wait. Look, you got people waiting for Adventureland. And then people waiting here for Fantasyland. Oh. Disneyland. We're gonna try to hit up the Haunted Mansion right now. Um, we just made rope drop. Everybody looks like they're going to Pirates of the Caribbean, which is which is a hot ride. But let's head over to the mansion and see what we can get. Zero chance. 
There she is. By extending help to those in need, two passion potions. Disneyland is where your imagination takes flight. Right. Your heart is that of a child's forever and ever. Yes. It's beautiful. It is. It's a beautiful thing. <laughs> This is my favorite, my favorite ride. Don't ask me why. Completely dark ride. You can smell the jambalaya getting ready, getting ready for me for lunch. But first, we're gonna go on Thunder Mountain. There it is in all of its beauty. All right, perfect. Look out for the goat. Look for the goat during the ride. When you see the goat, make sure you keep your eye on the goat. As you're going in, you know, around corners and so forth, keep your eye on the goat. Watch what happens. It's a very exciting, thrilling experience. I have yet to do it, but I got great resources who said that if you keep your eye on the goat, what you'll see or what you'll feel is something you can't explain. This is the thing, you got to look at the goat 
it's it's basically on a perch and it's it's why you're going around a corner it's about halfway through the ride it does make a difference it almost makes me want to go back again just for the goat So they have Beauty and the Beast at 11.30, 12.45, and 2, and Tangled at 3.45, 5. So maybe we'll try to hit up Beauty and the Beast at 11.30. What do you say about that? I say it's a good idea. Sitting right in front of the castle. It doesn't get better than this. It really doesn't. All right, guys, look, ice cream, look at me! Oh my. Got it! Thank you. you always have to have a chocolate chip cookie here. Mm. It's so good. You want to do a I'm little selfie? Around. Yeah. Okay, so I just met Tinkerbell. I'm not ashamed of it. That's probably the first of many princesses. Well, she's not a princess, but the first of many today. So if that disturbs you, you should probably end this vlog right now and move on to another vlog. Thank you so much. This is what I get all the time when I come here. Jambalaya cornbread. See this line? They put this rope up around 4.15, blocking off the entire street, the main street here for the parade. 